Oh, yeah. Stalks yeah, me. Look out, buddy. I now have to get into my Spider-Man abilities. <laughs> Let's look for Slinky now. Slinky! I can't believe we haven't found him yet. Slinky! Slinky! I can't believe he's not out here. Come in there and lift that lid up. All right, what's going on, everyone? Good morning to you. We're coming on into the croc habitat, croc monitor habitat. And um, today we are getting some things that needed to be done done. We got to clean up enclosures. We got to keep animals happy. And uh, these crazy little kids, these croc monitors have such incredibly sharp claws that they have ripped apart the outside of their little house. So today I'm just gonna go ahead and get some universal rock on that one side and we're gonna measure it right now. And um, while I'm at it, I think I'm gonna just go ahead and yeah. shut this so we have one less dangerous lizard to contend with we got that door shut so today it's all about just maintenance we are going to weed whack we're going to get into slinkies we're going to get into the gators we're going to see some animals and see how i maintain their habitats while they're in there and it could get a little spicy folks because you know what we will be in with some big gators ah but anyway you can see they kind of ripped this all down and now they're just shredding up this so i am simply friends thinking that i am going to just hide this whole thing with some universal rock i could even fold it down over this what do you think matt just kind of fold it down as long as i they can't get into it um i'm happy um and so if it looks like a little bit of a rock here it's fine with me i just want to get an idea of maybe the size I need to cut. So if I'm actually gonna do it like this, we're looking at about, I think two and a half foot would be more than enough uh, as far as tall. We would, the only thing I'm thinking looking at it is we'd have to make sure it's like sealed so that, yes. so that they don't get behind they it. Cause they love, Slinky loves to climb. They do like to get behind it, but what I can do is probably just tack it in really maybe nicely. take this off. Yeah, I don't know or tack it underneath tack it, it. Yep. yeah just tack it that way either way the stuff is really good in fact you know what i can go even so far as to here and cover up some of that ugliness so we're looking at about we'll just say maybe four uh three foot ten inches and then when i say two and a half foot up yep. all right let's go we're gonna go cut it and uh we're gonna mount it and then i gotta get to the real work which is weed whacking I just like to whack things down in here uh, because you don't want them hiding in the grass when you come in. You want to be able to see them. Uh, I think it's just a lot safer. And the same thing goes for slinkies. And of course, with the gators, we just want a clear area um, where we can operate. So there you go. All right, I'm gonna go cut this thing and we'll pick it up in a moment. Woo. Okay, so we got our piece cut. It's hot, by the way, in case you can't tell with all the perspiration. So what we're trying to do is we're just gonna anchor it down. I may have to make some relief cuts just to fold it over, but I think this is gonna look so much better and this stuff is durable. There's no way their nails are going through this. They actually use this uh, universal rock stuff in zoos in jaguar habitats, and if a jaguar's claws aren't going through it, croc monitors aren't either. So right now, the toughest challenge is, uh, you know, since it's a smaller piece, you gotta really bend it and that takes some muscle uh, and we're gonna anchor it down with our screws and of course when I feel like it I could come back and detail it um, this is literally a quick fix that's what we're doing so I'll probably have to do a relief cut um, in one of these here but in the meantime we're really gonna just try and push into this oh, God I didn't go far enough hold on here we go there we go that's one and then probably a cut here yeah so they don't climb yeah, right so in they here, don't go through we'll the... just oh <laughs> that didn't work now did it <laughs> i think i need a longer screw to be honest a little something with a little more bite a little bit a little, a little less bite. than her a little more, a little more than that, a little more action baby she's being so good looking at her. yeah she's terrified <laughs> She's just like, what are these people doing to my house? Maybe if I do the anchor point over here to start. Anchor it down here. Hopefully the drill's going in the proper direction. That makes it easier. Yeah, we just don't want them to get up behind this, uh, but that's easily remedied with 
More screws. More screws. Of course, the mail is inside. And I like it when it's folded and bent. It looks good. It has a cool look. It does. It looks like a natural rock instead yeah, of a wall. It, that's such an awesome uh, kind of function of this stuff. Yeah, look at how much better already. Yeah. And you, all we've done is place it there. Right. Looks so much better. Yeah, but it is tough working in here. It is. You no, know, and you got to be a little bit cognizant. Like, she's right there. Yeah, I know. Right there. I know, she is, man. Yeah. The other thing I can do is do spray foam. Yep. And kind and of fill the void. Take up the space. Yeah, because if they, if they can't really see a way in, they won't go in. Yeah, I'm going to go your way, buddy. So, yeah, just good times. You know, I'm going to hang out with you. Mangled by a croc monitor. And uh, the, always these quick jobs turn into long ones because I, I now have to, you know, get into my spider, Spider-Man abilities. You know, I got to just do things like this instead of just being smart and getting... Well, that's what I was going to say. It's all, it's all because we didn't want to do the proper prep. <laughs> that's it. Yeah. I, what, work and work this harder, not smarter. This is funner. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. Real fun. Is that a word? Funner? Funner? We just made one. People are making up words all the time. Why can't we? I love it. Look at that. Folding this stuff under. Yep, that's the, that's the money up. right there. That's good. That's good. Turn this into a branch. Yeah, why not? I mean, that looks great. Yeah, a little bit of spray foam around the edge so they don't get in, and that will be perfect. Yeah. You like that hat hanger? Yeah. Pretty good, eh? Very Croc Dundee. Yeah, man. It's very hot Dundee. That's oh, why they like it up in this corner. They do. They like to chill here because all the warm oh, settle. air gets caught underneath here. Did it even go into anything? I don't think it did. <laughs> I'm so half-assed sometimes. No comment. Get her done! Yeah. Oh, I know why. We do need a longer screw because there's the foam. Yeah, there's foam on top. There's foam on top. Like the R8 or whatever it is. Yeah, exactly. Pink foam. This stuff the right here. Panther foam. Foam home. So to be clear, you're screwing into a pile of branches. I'm screwing. Hoping that it hooks on something. Just Pretty so much. that the audience knows what we're watching. All they know is what we show them. Yes, you're being so good with yes. me right here. You thank you, thank you for not so maiming us. Super chill. You haven't even flicked your tail at me or anything. Just hissing. She's been great. She's uh, throwing her hissy fit, which is fine with me. She's hissy. good with me. Dude, I think I need a longer screw. Let's get a couple longer ones. Yeah, let's do that. Ah, whew. You know, I'm glad I waited until summer to start doing the yard work. Holy smokes, and that's the key. Once the rains come, vegetation, you gotta do this every week. Oh, you'll see in a minute. Right now we haven't even gotten to that. But what I wanna do is take that handy knife that you should have right behind you. I don't know if this is the right knife, buddy, but we're gonna make a relief cut. Oh, I like the serrated knife. That's good. That's good. Yeah, just a relief cut. And we'll do another relief cut there. But this will get us a nice, tight fit. We got some longer screws, which are helping us. Screws, cuts, and foam will get it done. That'll do it. Uh, at the end of the day, this is a quick fix to make this look more uh, beautiful, if you will. It does. It look. Yeah, I like it. I mean, um, you know, it is what it is. We try and keep things happy here. That's not the right screw. I went through, when I did my warehouse, I went through and uh, painstakingly saved screws. Um, so some of them are actually screws that were used. I don't know. My dad would be proud of you. Would he? Okay, because yeah. I'm cheap, dude. I'm thrifty. I ain't trying to spend hundreds on, on screws when there's perfectly good screws still available for me. I'm starting to talk nonsense on account. I'm tired, Jedi. My dad has jars of screws that his his father pulled out of boxes. Not even kidding. I love it. I love it. <laughs> Straightened nails. That's amazing. But we've used them. I grew up using all that stuff. That's so cool. So I, I like, you know, 
utilizing stuff. And sometimes people, they start making money and they think, well, just waste, you know, just, we can afford it. But I don't know, it just drives me nuts, man. What do you guys think? Am I crazy? Am I turning into a grandfather? We're just gonna check this out down here real quick. Go ahead, that's the uh, automatic water. Just letting you guys know that noise was not our sweat. It was uh, the watering, watering hose. Here we go. I love it. That's pretty good there. I don't think she's fitting through that, that's for sure. And then I could just wrap this around. I like it, we're almost done. Look how much better it looks. Oh, such a delight. Such a delight. I want to squish this one down. Just squish any possible entryway. Would you, hi young lady, don't go behind it while I'm doing this. I make a lot of that. Yeah, I need a smaller screw. Thanks, dude. Well done, well done. Okay. Now, the sketchy thing is now, we've got an animal cornered, and uh, actually, I need to get over where you are, buddy. I need to go where you are at. She's still pretty chill for how much time we spent I know, right, I know. It's right up in her business. My, yeah. my, you know, I just don't want to push it beyond totally. her ability to accept us. Oh, this looks so good. Yeah, this does look good. I'm glad we did this. Yeah, man. and it kind of it kind of blends with the wood too. It does. But it lightens up this dark corner as well. It I didn't does. Really think I, of that. I, I like it. It lightens it up. It yeah. brings a new airy flavor to it. A little bit more of an earth tone. <laughs> um, and uh, as my kids and wife would say, we Marie Kondo it. Do you guys know what we're talking about, Marie Kondo? Well, that's when they simplify it. I yeah. think. Yeah. I guess. I guess. All right. Well, yeah. we. Uh, what is it? Chip and chip gains. What yeah. are the design on the? I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, I don't watch television. Yeah. This is true. This is not something that we do a lot. All right, so I'm just thinking about a nice wrappy room. Tight here. wrap, a little foam. A nice tight bur burrito wrapper. Burrito wrapper. Right here, right there. Oh, hey, thanks. What a guy. Handyman ready. I, I just don't go. know what I did without you there, bud. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, nuts. That didn't work. We finished functionally screwing this in 10 minutes ago. This is just kind of... This is, that's exactly what this is. That's, that's, it's just, it's, you know, dialing it in. In fact, some would say that this might be boring and we should cut and uh, we'll get to, get to it when it's done. Okay, so I got a couple more screws to do, but if you notice our beautiful lady, Diamond is right there. And um, I don't want to put my face anywhere near her. She's cornered. She's already concerned about what's going on here, so I'm going to try and move her over. So I want you to step over that way. I'm going to use my good old hat here and just see if she'll move. What kind of attitude? There you go. That's what I want. That's all I wanted. Just show her the hat. Yep. She's moved. Now she's got. Now we've got space to work. Exactly. Okay. We. Oh, this is going to be perfect. This is going to fold down nice. She's been watching us. She's a beautiful girl. She is. She's being so good. I, I know. This is what happens when you spend a lot of time with your animals. You know, I spend time with her. I'm trying to reinforce better behavior. I think that's it, buddy. I don't see her fitting through that. Let me show you. I don't think she'll be able to get through any of that. And uh, it's pretty much tightened up in here anyway. And we just wanted to do it that way because we don't want her, we don't want her to uh, get in here during uh, the winter is what I'm most concerned about. I don't think about. she can fit in any of these. No, either. we'll put a little foam in here. There's right. a couple holes on this side. I'm gonna get down at the moment here somehow safely. Little. Look how much she's shedding. I don't know if you guys can see that, but she's got a lot of shed. 
She's happy she's growing. We are not about to rub it off like we do with Slinky though. <laughs> no. Can't do that with her. Are we? All right. Let me get out of this corner. On to the next. On to the next mission. Now we are done. Now for the easy part. Looking at this thing. Oh, it's white. No, no, no. That's bad news. I've never weed whacked with them in it. Never so weed whacked with them in it with yeah, the white she, blade. She came over right away. She did? Well, the minute we came in here and started, look she at this. came look down. At this. Look at this. Interested. Super curious. I'm not going to press the trigger. I want her to see it. It's not food. Not food. All right. That's good. I wanted her to just at least see it. Uh-oh. She definitely doesn't like the engine. Well, she's she's not sure about the white. I think the white looks like... We're gonna want to keep an eye on her. Yeah, I got that. I don't want to hurt her. I'm also, I'm not going full speed. Yeah, yeah, she's nervous. Let's go ahead and let him out. We're good, right? We're good. There he is. There's Chase. Lots happening here, buddy. All right, let's go. Oh, Jesus, don't die. Let's go see Slinky. We'll just walk right over there. I want to get a good fix on it. I don't want him to come uh, jumping from behind something. I don't see him over here. See if he's in his house. Slinky. If he is, just leave him in there. Lift that lid up. Oh, no, he's not in there. All right. Fix that in a minute. Well, where is he? I can't believe he's not out here. He's hiding somewhere. I'll start from the back and move my way forward. I mean, he didn't come out when I walked over there. Is he in the wall? Could be. Slinky. Watch the blood. Hmm. Let's look for Slinky now. I gotta get a good eye eye on him. Before he we could start be behind the wall. Spinning a blade in the side. Exactly. House. He could definitely be behind the wall. I haven't heard him rustle in here, just while we're standing here, I haven't heard anything. But there's a lot of digging along this. Yep. But that's normal. He, he always does it. Slank. Oh. 
When's the last time you couldn't find him? Oh, he was around yesterday. I can't he believe we haven't found him yet. I know. It's so crazy. Wow. God, it's so much lighter in here. I think that there's a part in the wall he likes to go in over here. Wow, everything's growing up so big. That's right. Blanky! Blanky! Hey, Blanky! Whoa. Oh, that's... Wait. Blanky! Huh. That's blanky? odd. When he goes in, doesn't it? It's usually over he's here, right? He's in here. There he is. He's in the water? He's in the water. Okay. It's so hot, he's in the water. You see Where? him down in there? Oh my God. Can Look you guys see him? Go ahead, give it a dunk, man. No way. Yeah, you can dunk it. Oh. You guys see him though? Oh my God. Look, he's found. All right, I'm gonna get to work. <laughs> Okay, it's time to go and get Snagglepuss, or Snaggletooth, and uh, Dale set up. Look at how much water Lots there is. Lots of water, yeah. Oh my god. Lots of rain, Look guys. at that, they come. Here they come. All right, I'm gonna leave this here. God, I can't remember the last time we saw it with this much water. Right? This is wild. All right, we're not gonna mess around. Get I'm done. I'm gonna just get right to work.
Yeah, the basilisk. Basilisk. Yeah. What are you doing, Dale? Jumping, dude. This is bad, people. Oh. What do you got? He's going right underneath there. Oh or trying God. to. He's just moving her out of the way. Those two are funny, man. I haven't seen them in this much water. This is so good. Isn't it awesome? It's so cool. And that's why I like to get in here and trim. I want to be able to see these animals. I want to see them doing their thing. It's also safer for me when I come and walk. Here he comes. Yeah, he's heading this way. She's heading this way. I just love these bridges for how we're able to get so close so quickly and move it's around amazing. in here. Like I never feel trapped in here anymore because we can always just jet. Exactly, he's he's beautiful. Yeah. Uh, there's one thing I wanted to do to make it a little bit easier for us here. Look at that. And I'm just gonna go ahead and- So huge. Yeah. yeah, definitely, That that's been a pain. <laughs> so that we can uh, get safely across that bridge. Perfect, maybe a little bit here. Watch yourself, buddy. I'm oh, dangerous. Me. Yeah, I'm. That's no news to me. Okay. Oh. oh, I love it. Yep, that's crucial being able to get through here without losing an eye. Yep, perfect. There you go. These guys are good. Wow. They're pretty good. Beautiful animals. Yep. Here she is. She can be a little surprising, so I'm super careful with her. Look at this guy. Come on, Snaggletooth. Get Look over here. here. You, you. Come on, buddy. Come here, buddy. And this is the best part. When I'm done working, guys, I get to hang out with my animals. I know that I did a job well done. They're both coming over. She's right behind us. Come on, guys. She is hauling. Snaggy. These guys are amazing. It is so incredible having these two dinosaurs living here with me. No, you see that? He's disappeared, oh. man. She look at stalks her. me, dude. She well, yeah. stalks me. You better me. look out, buddy. She can run right on up there. Like I said, the bridges, safety. They're gonna get excited because yep. they're gonna get fed soon. But you're gonna have to watch that on another episode. All right, guys, I need to take a break. This was one heck of a hot day working, doing some chores. Thanks for joining me. Uh, when I do this, I like to show you guys everything I do here at the camp. This is a real reality show, if you will. These animals need the attention, so does their enclosure. I absolutely adore being their steward, taking care of these critters. And uh, I just wanted to share with you a little bit of how I do it. Hope you enjoyed today. Thanks for doing the yard work. Now, isn't it funny? Yard work was something my dad was trying to get me to do when I was a kid my whole life. And now, I do it all the time. So I like to think of my father uh, when I do yard work because he was a lunatic. He would walk around with you. You missed, a ra you missed a leaf, you missed a branch. He was something else, but you know what? Now that he's gone, I miss him. I miss that kind of anal retentiveness of my father because he instilled a good work ethic in me and I'm really proud of what we built here and I did it with your help. So thank you guys so much. Thanks to Matt for hanging out and sweating with me and thanks to Dale and Snaggletooth for not eating me. And special shout outs to the Croc Monitors and Slinky. I need a tall glass of lemonade. See you later. <laughs>